this is why I wouldn't buy a Nest thermostat. I have one in my home which I'm renting at the moment, but I wouldn't they would definitely not buy a Nest thermostat because you see temperature it, I have set it up that it should stay between 74 and 78 means heat and cool heat when it's below 74 cool when it's above 79 so it is definitely uh, when it's above 78 so and it's 79 79 is definitely above 78 and this is already for 10 minutes and it's not doing anything and obviously the sensor is realizing that i'm at home so of course what i did i have set this is my settings here and i have set the eco temperature it's on on that means it should uh, unfortunately it's in German I don't know why still my browser setting is in German but anyway you can see echo setting is on and that means uh, when the sensor realizes that I'm not at home um, the temperature can go a little bit higher during the day and lower during the night it doesn't cool as much during the day and doesn't heat as much during the night so this is my understanding but of course as you can see uh, here it realizes that I'm at home because otherwise you wouldn't see the screen so bright it just turns the screen bright when I'm uh, home when when the sensor there's a probably an infrared sensor here built in in this uh, thing in the thermostat and it definitely realizes that I'm at home uh, but it doesn't turn on the cooling I mean yeah there's no no air no nothing so what I have to do usually I have to turn down the temperature to 77 and so that's two diff two degrees Fahrenheit difference and then cooling turns on I don't know why this is I haven't find, found out maybe there's a trick or something like that here in the settings again these are my settings apart from the echo settings I think everything is pretty standard normal uh, maybe you can find something here um, yeah I haven't I have checked everything as far as I have been yeah um yeah so it, it it doesn't make any sense for me so here's settings here you even see the uh software it's 5.9.3-6 uh it has been updated um december 12th so i think it's pretty pretty actual and everything seems to be good also battery it's almost brand new this thermostat and it doesn't do anything you have to turn it uh, you have to change settings uh, to two degrees difference and then it turns on otherwise it does not turn on so why is this I don't know I had thermostat which was super cheap uh, below $100 uh, even including Wi-Fi and when the temperature was higher then the settings it the AC turned on here that's not the case maybe it's too complicated my maybe just too complicated for me I don't get it uh, for me it seems to be too complicated it has a lot of features it has not, not a lot of nice features but maybe too many confusing features for me I would like to have a really simple setting like a, yeah maybe a not want setting and a simple setting uh, there's so many advantages which I have found so there are cool features within but there are so, uh, re yeah some at least some no-goes for me it's definitely not a buy at the moment so I hope I was able to help a little bit a little bit with that if you have any questions or comments just write to the comment section below I'm always happy to talk about these things and if you like the video give me a thumbs up subscribe my channel thanks for watching and see you next time